for religious tolerance and peaceful coexistence with one another. A community in Kaduna State has organized a unity carnival aiming to restore the missing golden days when ethnic and religious differences brought the masses together. The carnival was the Kanyumbanki Unity Carnival, where religious leaders, women and youth gather to celebrate and embrace peace with one another. While speaking to newsmen, the country's director of Global Peace Foundation and the chairman of Christian Association of Nigeria, Kaduna State Chapter, Reverend Dr. Joseph John Haya, noted that People live together in harmony, but because of the growing tension in Kaduna and in Nigeria as a whole, what the community decide to do is to make a proactive or take a proactive step to unite themselves. They call it High Mbanki Unity Carnival. So that they will not even give room. And I'm so happy that both their leaders, the youth, the religious leaders, the women, and all other stakeholders are collectively in this effort. If all communities will begin to start projects like this, then together we will fight evil and defeat evil. But if we wait until they strike and people are dead, when we come, we'll only be crying and blaming each other. So I salute Haim Banki for understanding, and that's why the Global Peace Foundation feels that, look, we need to identify with them. I had to travel all the way from Abuja this morning to come here just to be part of this very, very important occasion because it reminds me of the good days yesterday, and it also gives me that there is hope that this terrible thing we are seeing today, we will be able to overcome it when we continue to work together. Also, the village head of Hayambanki, Muhammad Shehu Galadima, pleaded that uh, I call for the government to intervene, especially in the youth, because without youth elevation, everything can take, uh, can take back out. So let youth be promoted, be awareness, give them the things that they are supposed to be known. Because youth, if you allow them, they can decide where they go. But call their attention, make them, give them empowerment, give them something to do. Don't allow them to decide where they can go. They can decide uh, otherwise. While these two persons also has this to say. We choose to be here in the aspect of as we want to address the issue of insecurity here in Haim Banki, on how to unite ourselves, on how to like as in talk about peace and um, to encourage ourselves about being united. Like just um, based on what the program says, we are all people, as we are people under one God. So we hope and we pray that as in this event, we unite us just like we, uh, the way we used to be. The call on religious leaders and youth is for we to come back together and make peace to reign. So that we join our hands together to bring peace in Nigeria in Kaduna, in Hanambek, in the whole world. So if the Muslim and Christian in the whole world can come back together and join their hands together, at least something will be done.